This is a Mars German elite division and Panzer Grenadiers from World War II. Each set contains 15 figures with 8 unique poses. Uh, first let's take a look at the elite division, aka Waffles. You know what I mean. So we have here a uh, illustration of some soldiers undercovered. A proposition of uh, painting figures. Okay, let's start of the unpainted figures. A grenadier with a Stegrenate. A simple rifleman, regular rifleman, sorry. This one is my favorite. I tell you why later. A uh, machine gunner with MG42. I like the details of the ammo belt over here. Okay, a kid soldier with a Panzer Faust. STG-44, Rifleman. MP-40, Submachine Gunner. And another STG-44, Assault Rifleman. And there's also an uh, officer, but you only get one. Uh, officer in the set. So uh, now let's take a look at the painted figures. Painted figures by me, of course. Uh, so that's um, officer of German elite division. This is a a late uh, early MP40 version. So we get a lot of details here. Seriously, um, this one is my favorite, one of my favorite. So we have here binoculars, a hat with uh, insignia. So his face expression is like, uh, go and fight. A grenade thrower with uh, Gavr 43. Rifleman with K98. This one is my favorite because the proportions are fine, seriously. This one is uh, the best. And what do I like in this set? Uh, first, the poses are uh, the poses are strong side of Mars. We get. Uh, only combat poses and what is also important, uh, every soldier has a different weapon. And what I don't like, uh, like Mars um, have this problem with the proportions. Now they deal with these problems and they seriously, and they release uh, a lot of good uh, sets like Volksturm. But just look at this one. This that's why I call this figure Kid Soldier. Just compare this with this one, and you can see not only the hat and hand is the problem here, but also the torso. Just imagine how he would look in a standing position. A little bit ridiculous. But uh, it can't be perfect.
I like this one. The STG-44 is one of my favorite weapons of World War II. And here we have an MP-40 submachine gunner. STG-44 assault rifleman. Like can you see here, the hands are definitely way too small for this rifle, but that's okay. Okay, and now the German Panzer Grenadiers with um, illustration of a soldier guarding a post. Why we didn't get this this kind of figure, this kind of pose? It will be cool to have this one. And here the proposition of painting figures. Okay, quick, let's take a look at the unpainted figures. So we have here an officer. That's a unique, something new. An officer with Walter and, sorry, it's not Walter. It's a Luger, Luger pistol with a stick grenade. A kneeling rifleman. Like problem with this set is also a proportions, but uh, here they definitely messed it up. And this is also one of the earliest set of Mars. Like look at those uh, those uh, big legs. They're way too big. Like here, let's take a look at this, so we can cl clearly see there is no proportions here. Okay, running MP40 submachine gunner, but uh, the poses are very good. I like them, and details are uh, are also great. But you know, uh, also one thing about this equipment, like it should be in one line. Like this, those uh, bag, this bread bag, shovel should be attached to a belt. And a sniper. Okay, now let's take a look at the painted figures. Here we have an officer. An MG42 squad. Like, this is awesome. So imagine, uh, imagine how soldiers used to have uh, damaged ears by doing something like this shooting from his back it would definitely damaged his ears now this one Okay, so that's all. Thank you for watching and see you next time.